all this crap right here. Yeah, oh, sh Whoa! Dude, there's hella crap in here. I'm missing them too. Alright, got this one. Here we go. There's this one walking around on him. Oh, there, there it is. Got him. Oh, you got one. Oh, no, that one has eggs. Okay. Yeah. Welcome back everyone. It's windy out, but we're out crabbing again. We're here at the Gulf side. It's kind of rare that I'm here. I'm usually at the Bay side, but um, at this time of year, there's a bunch of juicy female crabs with eggs that you guys can catch. And I'm gonna show you a bunch of fun little methods you can go grab our crabs with. I already saw a couple crabs out there. They're just walking around, but uh, hopefully we can get ourselves a dozen. Head back home and cook them. All right, see you guys there. Let's go look for some crabs. Ah, oh, there we go. Ah, oh, it's pinching me. But we got ourselves a crab. That's our crab number one. Whew. Oh no! Oh, win some, we lose some. Now crabbing with your hands right, is pretty right difficult. Right I'm not even sure if I recommend this because I'm an expert Let's and I get pinched all the time. Ow, 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 ow. When the crab pinches you, oh, you don't let go. No, you hold oh, on. Ow, ow, Just remember, ow. it's not life threatening oh, and geez. you're gonna regret oh, it if you oh, let go man. of it now. <laughs> Catching crabs with their hands is not easy, you guys. Oh my god. Oh man. We good, we good. Using something like tongs could help, maybe. Jeez, that's a big one. <laughs> that was a struggle, you guys. Noodling a <laughs> crab out of its hole. Man. I didn't even use the tongs. Here I am, stalking like a wannabe heron. Crabbing with your hands is painful, and the tongs are sometimes slippery and the crabs just get out. So when you get fed up with both of those, it's time to break out the chicken and the good old baited line. Sometimes you can see a crab in the corner and we'll do some sight casting.
So maybe your net is not flexible enough to reach, or it's not handy. You can use the bait to distract the crab and keep it from running away. Wait until the water clears up. Oh, there it is. Yeah, there we go. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Woo. Oh my gosh! Grab one. Uh, okay. He's mad. He's yeah. Once you get the hang of it, you can start raking them in. The Texas crabbing regulations are pretty lax. Five inch carapace width is hella small. No bag limit, no close season. You can probably even spear them because blue crabs aren't game fish. But you can't keep all crabs. All right, these crabs, they have eggs. We can't take them. The buried females right here, we gotta let these guys go. It's legal sized. Oh, there's another legal crab right there. Maybe I can get that one. But these guys, they gotta go back. Here. Oh, he's got eggs. Okay. That's so cool. Little crabs in the tide pool. That is so cool. Well, as you can see, there are hella crabs running around. But I'm all out of chicken. Um, I still want to catch one more crab, so I gotta do it a little old fashioned. There. I lost my chicken, so I'm gonna just have to grab this guy. Oh, oh he's got me, but I've got it too, so come on. Let's get him back. Yes, there we are. Ooh. Ow! Woo! Ah, ah, man. What would I do for a crab? Ugh. Ah. Wow, I am retarded right now. It's getting owned by this crab. There we are. Woo! <laughs> I got owned by this crab. Look at those bite marks right there. Oh, okay. 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 
Put them in a controlled position. All right, there we go. Man, look at those bite marks. Woo! <laughs> All right. That was a good catch. All right, you guys. How are you guys doing? Um, so I caught about a, a dozen crabs now. Um, I think I'm ready to head back. I lost both my chicken baits, and my hands are pretty torn up. Like, dude, check this out. Look at all this blood on my hands, man. It's, I think I'm about done for today. But before I go, check this out. This is huge. This is the biggest female blue crab I've ever caught. And, you know, this has got to be one of the biggest I've ever seen. It's like seven and a half inches. Carapace width? That's pretty sick, you guys. So, um, I'm going to head back home now. I'll get these cleaned up for a nice old crab dinner tonight. But uh, until then, um, Well, we got a pretty nice haul. One thing I don't quite understand is why these beach crabs, they they usually die. Huh? Oh, nice toad. Yeah, um, yeah I, I don't understand why these beach blue crabs, they, they die really quickly. I mean, they're, they're still alive, but like barely. Um, but there are like, there are a few that are still alive, so we good. Uh, okay. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty. Ah, baker's dozen. Okay, not bad. So we got thirteen this time. Um, pretty good. Uh, we're gonna be eating good tonight. All right. So I'll catch you guys inside, and uh, see you guys there. stuff right there those eggs that's what we want Whew. eggs the good stuff you guys well anyways um hope you guys enjoyed watching this here i am eating this crab um that certainly was fun it wasn't very easy to it wasn't as easy as i was as i thought it would be but we still got ourselves a little baker's dozen so we're doing good um get some of the body meat out Mm. Mm. Alright you guys, I'm 
gonna enjoy my female blue crab with eggs. You see the orange? So, hope you guys um, enjoyed the video and go find some female crabs yourself with some eggs inside. Until um, next time, thanks for watching.